Madam, from your test results here, I can see that you and your baby are doing very well. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, what do you mean by her and her baby? She's too old to be pregnant. Tony, you did not give birth to me, so keep my age out of the spatter. With all due respect, Mom, you're old, okay? You're maybe thinking you're not getting pregnant. Hey, shut up! You are disturbing my, my, my age with all this nonsense you are saying. Dr. Ujari, you see, I am still in shock as to this uh, pregnancy. Eh? And because uh, she had her period last, I think, about a year ago, and our last child is about 20 years old. So how come she is now pregnant again? To be alone. Your wife's case is not new in the medical world. Yesterday, she and I had a very long conversation in which I was able to ascertain that over the course of 12 months, she actually saw a period three times. Now, medically, a woman cannot be certified as undergoing menopause if her period has not ceased within the space of 12 months. And as you can see, she did see her period within those 12 months. And that case is what you call a perimenopause. Peri perimenopause. Peri yes, it's an early stage of menopause. Perimenopause. In which the woman will still be ovulating and, as you can see, very well get pregnant. So, this is what you are having is called a menopause baby. So, with your permission, I would like to start up for antenatal right away. Wait, wait, this is a joke, right? Wait. Please come on. Mom, this is a joke. Okay. Mom? Wait. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to yet another edition with the consultee. My name is Chacha Wabara. If this is your first time here, what we do are movie reviews. And if this is what you're looking for, please sit back and enjoy. If you're a returning viewer or subscriber, thank you for sticking with me. I do not take you for granted. If you haven't subscribed, please hit on the subscribe button. Turn up your post notifications so that you'll be alerted when a new video comes up. So today we'll be reviewing a Nigerian movie known as Too Old For This. Guys, this is a wonderful movie, okay? Starring Ebere Okaro and um, Jide Koshoko, Ruth Kadiri, Inem Peters, uh, Mofe Duncan, you know, and a host of so many other um, notable actors and actresses that you wouldn't want to miss. Now, this movie is centered around, uh, um, <laughs> it has lots of plots, right? On one hand, Ebele, Ebele Okaro and Jide Koshoko are old people, yeah? They have grown-up kids, and when they least expected, Ebele Okaro got pregnant, which wasn't something that they thought was possible. As a matter of fact, they were ready to, you know, carry their grandchildren. And there goes Ebele, who is supposed to be, you know, waiting for her daughter-in-laws to bring new kids or bring babies for her. Yeah. Instead, she was the one actually expecting. On the other hand, Ruth Kadiri is married to the, the son of Jide Koshiko and yeah. Ebele Okaro, which is um, Mofe Duncan, okay? They are struggling to have kids. They don't have kids, so... You know, Ruth Kadiri is obsessed with different methods, different things to do, remedies, right? You know, uh, with which to, with which they can conceive. It's a really trying time for them, and it has really turned their marriage um, um, to not be so wonderful. On the other hand, Ruth Kadiri is resentful of her mother-in-law for being pregnant and then um, goes out of her way to kind of like um you know mock her and she's upset from where ruth is sitting ruth feels her husband Mofe Duncan, is not trying hard enough for them to get pregnant and um kind of like fears that when her husband's um, parents have their new baby they will tell her to carry the baby and take care of the baby the nigerian movie that exposes or portrays what goes on behind the scenes what goes on in nigerian families what goes on what happens you know a desperate a, a mother or a, a woman who has been married for years desperate for a child uh, you know aged couple who are in no way expecting a new baby but her you know have been put in the family way so they are trying to figure out you know relieve that life again of having a baby that they don't just understand what's going on now before i forget there's a burial carol with her husband jide koshoko and she's resentful as well of her husband for make for you know making her pregnant so she tries in every way for her husband to participate in every single thing that she's doing Ah. 
You beat me. I didn't beat you, maybe. I didn't beat you. Mm? Now, become aside side my legs. They are hurting. <laughs> Bobo. Oh. I'm not your boy. No, no, no. You're my darling. Valachi, my darling. <laughs> I should massage you. Please. <laughs> Gentle. That's the spot. That is the spot. There. Oh, look at you. <laughs> it wasn't easy journey for her as well as her husband. It's a funny movie, a funny Nigerian movie, but not so funny as well. You know, something you can relate to it. You know, something that goes on every day in the in every Nigerian life or any life. You understand? So it, it you you kind of like are into the movie that's what the movie does for you that's what too old for this does for you you're inside the movie you're acting it out with them and you're enjoying it you're enjoying the movie every bit of the way the production was wonderful lighting sound everything kill everything on point okay but where I really um, kind of like I wasn't smiling too much was the way Ebele was Ebele Okara was um, you know when she was pregnant like oh go and cook this go and cook that she made it seem like you know really enough she wasn't she she, she wasn't saying okay give, let me give you an instance go and cook indomie i want indomie with this i want indomie with that i want indomie with this do the indomie like this and do it like this now when jide koshoko is doing those things she's kind of like reeling it out like you know she's on a book like it's it's on a paper i want this i want this i want this like you know She's reading out the script as the director gave it to her. So she didn't make it sound convincing. And, um, you know, to marry with that time, what that thing that was happening, that's the only flaw. Not even much. Everybody acted brilliantly. Ruth Kaderi was ooh, wonderful. Everyone gave it their all. You know, the switching of, um, you know, Ebele is Igbo in the movie and she married a Yoruba man, Jide Koshoko. So sometimes she would just be, you know, speaking Igbo like, look at this man sleeping or this, that one happening with this. You know, it showed that intertribal uh, marriage and how, you know, you cope. It was beautiful. I don't have any problem with, with, with Too Old for This. It's a movie that you can, you know, Saturday chill, you know and relax binge watch on you know wonderful movie that you must watch which brings our movie review to an end if this is your first time joining me please hit the subscribe button turn up your post notifications so that you'll be alerted when a new video comes up i'll see you next time bye